Hello, folks. How you doing? Yep. Back again. Yeah, another late one. Yep. Hang on. Yeah, I waited all day for Sarasota Tim to bring something around, and you know, I don't know, maybe he's just laying a little low. Maybe he's just trying to get all his senses back and everything like that because, uh, you know, he's not really working very hard. If you saw his t-shirt today, yeah, it was pretty pretty clean, you know. You know, they're just doing that porch and it's taking them forever. It's like, uh, you know, he says, well, yeah, Miss Jolene, she fi fixed me up some eggs and breakfast this morning. And then, um, for you know it, I don't even think they went to work. Yeah. Next thing I see, they're having a salad for lunch. And then he said, well, we're going to get started on that porch. So, yeah, I don't think so. I think they only worked probably a couple hours on it. Hang on, there's hair there or something. I don't know, it's floating around. So, yeah. So, yeah, it's been pretty uh, dead on the Sarasota channel. And, yeah, I don't think anybody else is putting anything out. You know, he probably, <clears throat> excuse me. But, yeah, oh, well, you know, that's just the way it is, you know. Sometimes you got content, sometimes you don't. Maybe that guy needs to get back on the road or start talking about Social Security or something because, uh, yeah. But I think he's leaning a little low on the Social Security and, you know, the Medicare thing. I think maybe he thinks, well, maybe he's going to get in trouble or maybe somebody came. I don't know. Maybe it's... Maybe he got a lawyer. I don't know. Maybe he's talked to some people. But anyways, uh, it's going to be a little different. I was Tonight, I just thought maybe I'd just bring you a few things on, uh, you know, these grifters out here. Like I said, they're, they come in all different shapes and forms. And, you know, they're Sarasota Tim, but there's some that are a lot worse. I mean, when I talk about grifting, I mean, they are asking for money here and there and everywhere. Yeah. And you know, we, okay, this is my thoughts. Just my thoughts. Okay, this channel, it's not uh, monetized. I didn't come on here to make any money. Yeah. If they want to give me money, yeah, I mean, YouTube wants to, but nobody else, I don't want them to. Yeah. It was my choice to do this. My choice. So when I hear, you know, these YouTubers get out there, you know, they made the choice that they wanted to either go out and live on the road or, uh, you know, camp or whatever. And then they start begging for extra money. No, uh-uh, no. I mean, it's just like going to work, right? Yeah, the employer says, you're going to work for me. You know, you give me an honest day's work and I'll give you an honest day's pay. That's the way it works. Hour for hour, you know? I mean, yeah. So, you know, you got these, uh, you know, they're, you know, YouTube's paying them. You know, if you get monetized and you get the hours and everything like that, you know, it all depends on the channel. And I guess it all depends on, uh, you know, the advertisers or whatever. And it can go all over the place. I'm not an expert. I just looked up some things. That's all. Hang on. We got the beer, oh, beer of the night, I guess you could call it. Usually you don't have beer this late, but, you know, you know. So we got the Kona, big wave. Yeah. I guarantee you I won't finish this. I just need something from my throat. Because I like to talk. Old people like to talk. Because nobody comes around and visits them no more. So, anyways, let's see where we'll start. So, I'll tell you. YouTube pays out 68% to the content creator. Okay? And YouTube takes 32%. So, you know, you make some content out there. I'm talking about, you know, your monthly check that comes in. So, YouTube's going to take 32% because you know what? You're on their uh, platform, and, you know, they're you're storing all your stuff. They're putting it all out. They're putting it on, you know, getting the advertisers. Yeah, they're making a lot of money. They sure are. So, okay, so 
you're still making 68 percent let's see if you get a okay the average okay let's go by that so if there you let's just say you get a thousand views you know you can make anywhere from a dollar to thirty dollars for a thousand views and then it's a but they say the average realistically is about five or ten dollars for every thousand okay that's just i'm getting this off the you know when i type it in so anyways and then uh if you have super chats you know the youtube super, super chat oh god yeah you know how they go on there and they say hey you want to give me a super chat and i'd love it they get on their live and they say oh man it's hey thanks for the super chat just remember when you're contributing you know what youtube's taking 30 percent of that so if you're donating to the creator oh man yeah youtube's taking 30 percent right off the top okay and then if you go to uh uh let's see what is it oh man let me see okay so you got those uh channel memberships you know they say oh yeah come on over to my channel here and i'll give you a if you get a membership for 2.99 or 4.99 and you know i'll either give you a gold star or i'll just highlight you or just give you a shout out and put your name up on the screen there yeah so they'll do that youtube's still taking 30 percent of that yeah they're gonna take that so they're gonna take well what if you have three dollars you're giving them what is that 90 cents something like that they're getting so yeah and then you got the buy me a coffee now that's not a youtube thing okay and i guess that's probably one of the better ones to you know that's why you know sarasota tim and you know you get some of the others out there say hey man buy me a coffee of course you're not really buying them a coffee yeah you're just giving them money is what it is they're just trying they're trying to make it sweeten it up for you to make it sound like you could say send me a twinkie or you know whatever a candy bar or you know, a beer or something like that. Yeah, so let, let me give you that. You can still kind of put that on your channel there, you know, in the links or something, I guess, is to buy me a coffee. And that's all they got. All they do is take 5%. It's a transaction fee. So the creator gets 95% of that. That's why they like it so bad. So, yeah. So you got uh, Sarasota Tim. Let's just say he gets like a hundred dollar bill or something. You know what that's going to be. Yeah. So, yeah. So, yeah. The company is only taking 5%. Okay. That's not even a YouTube company. Okay. Or Google. So then we got. Um, oh, there's another thing. I couldn't believe it. They said some YouTube creators. Oh, I better look it up here. Some tube creators are, are earning a six-figure income just on buying me a coffee. Man, I wonder how much uh, Sarasota Tim and all the others are getting. I mean, man, he never not complaining about money, is he? Yeah, you know, maybe I was thinking today, too, since he doesn't look like he's much of a, 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 a physical labor guy, you know? He likes just to talk. You know, the salesmen and all, and they're not much into the physical labor. Maybe he likes to, you know, maybe he needs to really step up to the plate and say, Hey, Teddy and Miss Jolene, I've got it. Let's get some guys. I'll hire some guys, get them in here, and we'll get this thing built in a day. Yeah. Don't you think that's about right he should do for those two, for him staying there? I don't know. Maybe he pays them a little rent or whatever, but... I would say, yeah, or even the boat deck out there. Yeah, let them hire some guys to come in there and fix that. Yeah. That way you don't have to do it. And you can still go out and film all your stuff and do your content. Because right now you're losing money. <coughs> Excuse me. Yeah, you're just losing money. I think it would be to your advantage just to hire some some guys come in there and 
do all that labor work for you and everything, and you could still go out and film your six videos a day. Yeah, and then you can just let Teddy kick back because, you know, he probably just really wants to work on his, his classic car he's got there. You know, and Miss Jolene, she probably, like, it'll give her time to cook. Hey, did you notice? I mean, especially today. Oh, my God. Teddy and Jolene, they got some guns. You noticed it. Oh, yeah. I mean, for 80-some years old and 70-some years old, those two are fit. They really are. I don't know. Maybe they go to the gym. I don't know. But, man, they are fit. I mean, I was telling the wife that. I said, look at the guns on Miss Jolene. So, anyways, yeah, I know I'm getting off subject, but, you know, we're kind of mixing it up here a bit, okay? So, let me flip around here and see what else we got. PayPal, you know, a lot of them like to push push PayPal, too, because, you know, most people have PayPal or app or something. They only charge 2.89%, so 2.9% 2. a charge, and then uh creator gets the rest of the money. Yeah, it's just a service fee. And then they got, uh, oh, uh, Patreon. Now, not too many are getting into that. I don't know. I think I think a lot of them are kind of getting out of the Patreon thing because that's a separate kind of, uh, you know, deal. And then they got to put up photos or whatever they're going to do on Patreon. I mean, you can go over there and have, you know, live chats. You know, Nomadic Fanatic does that and shows himself getting drunk on there and crying and everything. Oh, yeah. He's got some drama on his stuff too, you know. Nomadic fanatic, yeah. He 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 he's been caught on that. Yeah, I got banned off of that. Yeah, because I uh, released some info on that. So, anyways, he still says I own all that creation on there. Don't be telling nobody that. So, anyways, yeah, I can't get on there no more. So, uh, yeah, they charge eight to twelve percent. You know, monthly earnings on there. And then, uh, plus a processing fee. So, I don't know how much the processing fee is. Yep, hang on. So, yeah. So, some of them will only use a few things. And some use more of them. And so, I go on. Oh, coyotes are going. Oh man, they feel they sound like they're just right outside. Uh, my dog's probably gonna wake up and go crazy. So, anyways, uh, yeah. So, anyway, so some of these sites in this case, okay. Like I, I talked about Manny Van Haley and Amanda. Yeah, let me let me give you a picture here. I guess I guess uh, you know Amanda says she was going up to Payson, Arizona. To her mom's other place or trailer she said oh yeah maddie van halen's gonna be coming up and helping us and everything yeah here they are here's two lovebirds aren't they cute yeah anyways yeah they went up there and so now you know where maddie van halen is so maybe it doesn't feel so skittish or something but i guess those two lovebirds hooked back up again i don't know because last time for over a month or more. Yeah, he took off from Yuma down there because she had some other guys come in there and they were all camping together. And I think he got a little jealous, but her or something. So he took off and pout, 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 you know. And then, so she just did her own little thing and went off with the guys here and there and traveled up to Nevada and everywhere else. And he just kind of pouted around and puttered around, you know. Arizona, and as soon as she came back to Arizona, he ran up to Nevada. I guess he didn't want to be seen around, run into her or something, and the guys, I don't know. Who knows? But anyways, I guess they made up now. Yep. But, uh, yeah. So anyways, I was talking about them. So I went on their site to see what they, what they doing. Oh my God, you go down in there. Oh, my God. So, they both got a membership thing going on. Okay? They'll give you a gold star, okay? And then you got the 
You got, um, they all got, uh, here, I'll tell you. Matty Van Allen's got one for Cash App. He's got an account there. Hey, man, you could, if you got Cash App, send me some money. PayPal, Venmo, Amazon Store, Vis uh, Verizon Visible. Hey, use my link here. You know what? You'll get so much off and you'll give me a free month of Vis Verizon Visible, just like Sarasota Tim. Then uh, Amanda, she's got PayPal. She's got the uh, YouTube, you know, membership too. She's got the Venmo. She's got the Cash App. She's got a Patreon. So, yeah, they all go. And then, uh, but Sarasota Tim, all I can find on him, all he's got is his at, uh, Amazon link and uh, buy me a coffee. He's trying to keep it simple, I guess. But, uh, you know, he could get a little bit more. Maybe if he gets some extra time, he'll add some more stuff in there. Hang on. And I was talk talking about, like, uh, Nomadic Fanatic. Yeah, he's only got Patreon and PayPal. So some of them, you know, I guess they don't want to deal with all that other crap. Or, you know, they're making them, they're making enough off of their channel instead. But what I'm trying to get at is they're all grifters. That's what I was trying to get at. Is that, you know what, getting back to the main thing here is that my viewpoint is, if you want to... If you want to go out there and you want to make money and you want to make films or you got you want to make money so your content whatever you're putting out should pay f that's the, that's what you should be judged on okay there's a lot of creators out there oh man they got some nice stuff they got you know they'll go on for 30 minutes maybe an hour even you know backpacking camping and you know a lot of stuff you know, there's a lot of, these grifters give everybody else a bad name, but you can really point them out real quick, you know, it's just like, you go on those channels there, like, the Miss Doctor, or Miss, Miss Pharmacist, or something's out there, and she's traveling around, and, you know, she's always, you know, giving you the little extra shot, you know, there of her, and, you know, out in her bikini, and all, all these girls are doing that, oh, I gotta go out to the, hot pools or hot tubs or something like that, you know, and it's like, oh, yeah, I know what you're doing it for, yeah, hey, they get all the views, that's for sure, but, yep, they're using their body for it, and I guess there's no problem, but, you know, it's just as, hey, I think, hey, it's almost just like they're in a, they're in a, a strip club, or, you know, they're right in the polls, what I think, but, uh, anyways, yeah, so anyways, yeah, these these they put the content up and everything. I don't know. I I I think that hey, you know what? It goes by views. I don't agree with this uh go buy me a coffee and you know all this other crap, you know, like PayPal and Venmo and Cash App. Oh yeah, just send me money here. Or they buy the membership thing. No. You know what? They should, they should just, uh, now they're just begging, you know, why don't they just go out and hold a freaking sign on the, on the street corner or something. So they're just giving everybody else a bad name is what I think. So, yeah, that's just my feelings, my opinion, everybody to their own. And, uh, yeah, so thank you for, we got any new subscribers, maybe a couple there. Thank you to, uh. To the negative commenters out there, there's some dude on there, Troy, uh, I don't have it here, I, I should get his name up there and give him a shout out, you know, he's, you know, whatever, I just give him a cheers, you know, and we got some preacher on here, said he's going to pray for me, well, hallelujah, I've been saved already, okay, I don't need that, but, uh, you know, hey, eat to their own, and I don't know what else more to say. I just have to say, well, good night or good morning. Because this probably come out in the morning. We'll see what goes on. But I don't know. I don't think we're going to get too many people are going to go through for 20 minutes of my jib jabbing about this. But hey, that's just my feelings. Yeah, there's not much more. So we will see you later, okay? Bye.